Hey, what's up guys? Sam Acevedo here, uh, here with another video. Last video we did the carbon fiber mirror caps. This video we work on the rear end. Now, looking at the diffuser here. I'm going to change the stocky out, even though it is an M Sport. Now you need the M Sport bumper to do this, uh, to do this modification. Um, but we're going to remove the diffuser and add a little bit of carbon fiber. There it is. Who doesn't like a little carbon fiber, right? Um, and you know what, at first I was a little iffy on adding carbon fiber to the black car, right? I was afraid that I, you weren't gonna see it. But you know what, after adding a few pieces here and there, I'm modding it anyways, why not? And you can still see it, especially when the light hits it. Um, I think this piece here, now I got this diffuser from BWE Customs. Eric Santana to the rescue. He posted this up on Instagram and I hit him up right away, right? You can't get this anywhere for a decent price. Um, again, you can go on eBay and get the cheap stuff, but this is some good, good material here. I mean, it's, it's solid all the way through. It looks great. Um, I think it'll add an aggressive look to the rear end. And who doesn't like a rear end? Um, so what we're gonna do, we're going to take the first one out. Uh, it's just a couple bolts at the bottom. And then it pulls out. All right, this is the top. Little clips. Should pull out. And then we should be able to put this in. I may have to drill a little bit of hole, like some holes here at the bottom. Uh, but that should be super easy. Um, so let's get to it. So once you unscrew the bolts at the bottom, you just grab it and it pulls right out. And it's out. Easier than I thought, or easier than expected. Remove the bolts at the bottom, eight mil, and then once that's off or flapping off the car, you're going to have to come under with a flat head and push on these uh, little, they're not clips, but they're attached to this fuser. You're going to have to push them off or out of the bumper hole. So we're going to do the reverse. Keep that. The reverse is we're going to insert the top, which it looks like there's no hook or anything on here. So oh, this one does have one, that one does have one. So that will attach the middle and the sides and then uh, the bottom, all you need is to put the eight millimeters back. Uh, before I mount it to the car, I'm gonna pre-drill uh, the holes. Goes nothing. So I drilled the uh, pre-drilled the bottom ones. Even though you don't necessarily need it because this is pretty stiff, the middle is not going to wobble. Uh, but I did it anyway. Um, so let me insert it. Starting from the middle. As you see, the diffuser is in. Now, warning. Warning, right? I don't know if I could do this. Warning, right? It will need some 
modification. So it will need a little bit of trimming. The clips that clip into the bumper, not the right size. They're too long, they're too fat. You gotta trim them, you gotta make them shorter. Uh, they're, they're, uh, they're too wide for the holes. Uh, it doesn't allow the rest of the diffuser up on the top part to clip in. On mine, they didn't go in at all. The end, the one at the very end, do not go in. So on my diffuser, the way I have it, I did trim it, but the ends do hover a little bit. Uh, so uh, just keep that in mind. I mean, it does look really good. It's super stiff. I mean, it's it's definitely made out of carbon fiber. I mean, when I was trimming, I mean, there's shards going everywhere. But, um, and also, you know, obviously be careful. Uh, I think it looks good. I think it changes the rear end. Uh, gives it that fatter booty at the end. Um, I think I even uh, could pull off a more aggressive spoiler. I know some of you don't like the express, like the, the, high, the high one, but I think I could pull that off. Um, I think the diffuser paired with the lip, paired with the, the uh, side caps, or the uh, mirror caps, and the front lip. I think that's all the carbon fiber I'm gonna do on this car. Um, but I think it, it kind of pulls everything together. I still think out of all the diffusers that I've seen out there, uh, BW has the best price and they're available. Uh, so uh, if you don't want to go eBay, go that route. Um, just expect some trouble. That does it for this video. Please like, comment, subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one.